The idea started during the height of the pandemic, as many got their COVID vaccines. Many, many people came through. There was a big rush to get vaccinated, and we saw an opportunity to study something that we didn't know much about. So we were looking at immune responses to COVID and to vaccination. Many wondering if it made a difference in which arm you received the shot. The arm randomization was just a sort of an afterthought. We really just knew that we were vaccinating kind of randomly in different arms, but we didn't know if it mattered. We'd always assumed it didn't. The study by the Oregon Health and Science University measuring the antibody response of 947 people who received two-dose COVID vaccinations. Let's just divide our group in half roughly and randomize them and make one group ask one group to switch arms and the other group to stay with the same arm. Those results finding when participants switched arms for each dose, they had a one and a half to two times more the antibody levels in their blood. Any, any small increase in antibody levels, like a two-fold increase, would translate into mortality benefit for those most vulnerable to COVID and those most likely to experience a bad outcome. Participants say the study could also encourage more to get vaccinated. The more efficient you can make the vaccination process, the fewer times that people have to get vaccinated in order for it to be effective, the more likely they are to get the vaccine. Including those most reluctant to get them. No promises to parents, but it could be that this increased um, immune uh, response that we're seeing by alternating the sites could mean maybe one or two less doses for their child.